Galvanic Applied Sciences 903 Analyzer Maintenance Video. Changing the Tape. Before doing any maintenance, take the handheld keypad for the 903 analyzer. Press Bypass to prevent any alarms from engaging. You will know Bypass is activated when you see the flashing orange light below the display. When maintenance is complete, press Bypass again, the orange light will stop flashing. To remove the tape, remove the dust cover. Unscrew the two guide reels. Remove the spent tape. When changing the tape, we recommend cleaning the sample chamber sensor before a new tape is put in. Begin by opening the top hatch of the analyzer and detach the tubing that flows from the humidifier to the sample chamber. Remove the sensor dust cover. Remove the two screws that hold the sample chamber in place. To pull out the sample chamber, pull back the compression head and twist to expose the sample chamber opening. With a Q-tip or paper towel, clean the sample chamber opening by lightly wiping off any dust buildup which could interfere with the sample reading. Reinstall the chamber. Make sure the compression head lines up with the sample chamber and reconnect the tubing. Take a new package of Galvanic Applied Sciences lead acetate tape. Remove the tape from the package and make sure the stamp is facing away from the analyzer. Disregard the outermost layer of tape, as it can leave a mark that will cause a bad analysis. Install the new tape on the bottom and replace the guide reel. To feed the tape through the analyzer, start at the lower guide pin, pull back the compression head, and slide the tape past the sample chamber. Feed the tape over the upper guide pin and over the tape counter. Once the tape is guided through, take about one centimeter of tape, fold it over, and insert it into the slot on the take-up hub. Take up slack by winding back the lower spool. Next, use the keypad, press Tape Advance, which will cause the take-up hub to turn and wind on the tape. Once that is done, screw on the second guide reel and replace the covers. Now that the tape is replaced, you should recalibrate the sensor. Press F4, then press F1. Once inside the menu, use F4 and F3 to scroll down until you get to SendCal. Press the Edit key and press Enter to toggle SendCal to the On position. This will initiate sensor calibration. This process takes about 30 seconds. Press Exit to get back to the main menu. Next, reset the tape counter. Press F4, then F1. The first item on the list shows the amount of tape left. To reset this number, press edit and enter the number of feet left, about 328 for a new roll. Press enter, then press exit to get to the main menu. The procedure for changing the tape is finished. For further questions, please contact Galvanic Applied Sciences.